it's a crazy hair day at school today. So I decided to, I just did a little bit of ratting at the top, but this is my um, normal hair. So I decided to wear that to school. But um, it's not crazy hair day everywhere else. It's just crazy hair day at the elementary school. So it's very possible that I stood by my window and checked to make sure that nobody I knew was outside because I live in an apartment complex. So there's always people I know walking past. And then I made like a mad dash to my car when I knew that nobody was around. And now I'm like wishing for the first time ever in my life and probably the only time ever in my life that um, daylight savings time was over right now so that it would be dark on my drive to school so that nobody can look at my car and be like, oh my gosh, what in the world? Cause like, you know. I have a feeling some of the older teachers at my school are gonna think like, oh my gosh, that's how I used to do my hair every day. Cause I'm telling you, my hair was born in the wrong decade. It was. So yeah, this is me trying really hard not to look like a crazy witch woman on the way to school and hiding so that everybody who is not celebrating crazy hair day doesn't wonder what in tarnation is she doing? Let me just say though, that wearing my hair like this is a huge step out of my comfort zone. <coughs> Excuse me. So normally, I, generally speaking, I care quite a bit about what people think of me. And so I try very hard to fit into societal norms so that people don't think I'm weird or crazy, right? But yesterday I was like, oh, I kinda wanna do crazy hair. Like I never got to do crazy hair day. I didn't go to a regular elementary school, you know? And so I'm like, oh, I never got to do that. I kind of want to do that, you know? And so I was like debating and deciding, like I have naturally crazy hair. I am the prime candidate for crazy hair day. So I told my kids, if you can earn 30 marbles for our little prize jar, so it's like a whole class incentive, then I'll do my hair crazy. And I had complete control over that situation. I'm the one who gives out the marbles. I could have very easily said, mm, you won 20, but that wasn't quite enough. Sorry, I'm not gonna do it. But I was like, ah, oh, I'm gonna do it. And they did try most of them pretty hard. They probably didn't deserve all of them, but like, you know, it's a once in a lifetime experience. So I'm grateful to my students for helping me break out of my comfort zone a little bit and like being brave and bold and exciting. <laughs> Your hair is exciting. It's from Megamind. It's a great quote. I use it all the time. It's true today. Anyway, so I'm grateful to my students for helping me break out a little bit and live a little. And yeah, hopefully they like what they got. Because I feel like this is crazy. At least for like me. I know it's not like I didn't make like an octopus with my hair and I don't have like trash sticking all over it and stuff. But like it's deflating a little bit. So I'm going to poof it up when we get back to school. But like... I feel like this is pretty insane. You know what else is insane? The fact that I hid from people in my apartment and I'm considering posting a video of myself this way on YouTube. Good news, back, back to school night. Oh my gosh. Good news, crazy hair day went really well today. That was awesome. Yes, my hair is now back in a ponytail because I had to run errands and I'm not running errands with my hair like that. My favorite description of what my hair looked like, it was a hit, by the way, with the kids, was that I got electrocuted. And to be totally honest, that's, yeah, it's pretty much what it looked like. It was huge and everywhere in my face all day, but it was also like incredibly liberating to just like, whatever not even care. I was one of the only teachers that did crazy hair day and I think by far I was the most risky. Most people do like cute crazy hair day. Like spray paint their hair cute colors or make it like stand up funny on their head. Like that's cute. It's crazy but it's like cute. My hair was insane. Okay so I think I win crazy hair day. Anyway it went well. My confidence is boosted. The kids loved it. I'm gonna go do my hair so I look normal for the rest of the week. I feel like tomorrow I need to wear like an extra put together outfit with my hair real nice and done to like redeem myself from today. Though to be honest, I tried really hard to dress cute. Like I got like a necklace and I'm wearing my bright pink flats. Like I tried to be extra cutesy because my hair was going to be all over. I couldn't have it look like I didn't try. See, it's already coming out of the ponytail holder. No winning. Anyway, just wanted, yep, yeah, sorry. 
Just wanted to update you on Crazy Hair Day and how that went. I had a lot of kids participate. Anyway, yep, that's all I have to say today. Happy Crazy Hair Day. See ya.